Hey guys, here with a hands-on look of the new YouTube app update that has been starting to roll out today. But I also want to rant about something in this video. But first of all, let's talk about the new updates in this uh, app. Uh, first of all, when you open it up, you're going to notice right away that it's white, white, white. Everywhere you look, it's white. Um, the, black, the border, this over here used to be black. Uh, or not black, it was like a charcoal, very nice looking looking dark color right there um that's gone now it's totally white and everything else like you can see it's totally totally white when you go to your subscriptions now instead of seeing um these are all your subscribers instead of seeing the icons of the people you are subscribed to like you would before uh now you don't see that all you see is the video and the title and the views that's it that's all you see now you can have it landscape mode and that's the way it looks still looks good I'm not complaining about the looks of this app it looks very cool uh, also when you tap right here now you could f without opening the video you can add the video to watch it later look at that very cool just without opening the app over here of course this is the Chromecast um, icon you're not gonna have that unless you have a Chromecast in your home but since I have it that will always be there uh, the other big big update is let's go to one of my videos over here Let's go to play one of the videos when you load some of the videos You can also click right here and you can see the description which is very cool. They did a very good job there Also here you can see the comments blah 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 all that But the biggest thing here is that when you're playing a video you can hit right here or hit right here and it will automatically reduce all of it its size all the way over there and that the video is still gonna be playing and that lets you multitask that lets you keep on browsing all your videos uh, looking for new videos whatsoever everything you could want to um, here you could just tap and it will go back up or you could just hit here again go down or over here there's another icon right there it'll go down as well um, also here you can slide up and it will expand the video again but uh, for me it's way easier to just just tap and that's it also if you want to get rid of the video you could do this and it will automatically fi finish the video it will disappear the video that's very cool um, another thing that they did which I'm not I'm not in favor of is that now you can't tap on your username see you can't tap on your username and see your all your subscribers and see your all your videos views all that and all that nice thing right there you can't do that no more which totally totally sucks I think that totally sucks but the app runs and plays the videos very cool it looks very nice and I like over here like you see uh, this border right here looks a little bit translucent you can actually see behind this bar which is very cool it has very nice effects my rant is all the updates this app has got uh, this is by far this is let me see this is version 5.021 there's been lots and lots update for this app and I've been sending lots of feedback because still till this day there is no inbox what the hell there is no inbox and don't tell me that Google and its developers cannot put an inbox in this app that is total BS um, that's why I just keep on going to my browser over here when I go to the browser Google listen to me I could go ahead and tap right here and tap right here and go to my um, inbox and I could go ahead and reply to messages here without going to the YouTube app now why can I do that very very nicely very very easy on the mobile version of YouTube but I can't do it on the YouTube app that is total BS uh, another thing that it won't let you do is um, it won't let you reply to messages either if I want to reply to a message let's say there's no reply button right here see I tap right here there's no way 
to reply to any of the messages which for me it's totally stupid that I can have total control of my YouTube app with my account not non scroll ever so why make all these awesome great updates if you're not gonna let me use this app at its full potential I want to use this app as my number one way to go when I'm going to YouTube if I want to go to YouTube this is the app that I want to go to I don't want to have to go here to my browser and go to my inbox reply to messages I can also tap right here and I can see my account like you see right here I can see my recent uploads my popular uploads I can see everything here if I go over here to about I can see my links my my social networks I can see my subscribers my video views my total video uploads I can see everything the mobile version of YouTube is way more functional way more complete than the YouTube app uh, that is total BS it shouldn't be that way uh, especially when this is an app from Google um, there is an option right here feedback when you click right here you can send the feedback before I did this video I already sent this feedback already and I've done this over and over again every time Google releases a new update for the YouTube app I send reply I said feedbacks guess what I never get nothing in return never get a message back from them so I hope by making this video I hope they actually listen to me and put the freaking inbox why can I get the freaking inbox Okay, guys, I'm sorry for my rant, but I have to let it go. I hope Google watches this freaking video and put me a freaking inbox right there. Okay, till next time, guys.